Hey you guys, I'm Brian Paul, and it's time for some more PlayStation VR breaking news. First up, I know a lot of you have been holding off on buying Separation until it got its first patch, and luckily that patch is finally here. It includes a few bug fixes, smooth turning, an overall graphics boost with a huge improvement in draw distance, and a few control tweaks that make the game in general much more enjoyable to play. Blindspot also got a nice update with patch 1.20 that addressed quite a few of our concerns, like an increased movement speed for the default setting, and surprisingly, a slightly improved English translation for the in-game text, which was spotty at best until now. Also, expect some of those bugs in Chapter 3 to have been ironed out as well. Next up, in preparation for the release of the upcoming Pixel Rips 1995, Pixel Rip 1989 has gotten a permanent price cut from $25 down to $15. It's one of those games that should probably be on every one of our top 20 lists, but like so many other great PSVR games, it just never makes the cut. So make sure you check this one out for yourself, if you haven't already. Play inside, outside, during recess, even during class. Just don't get caught. The upcoming Honor and Duty Steampunk, shown here in an extremely early state with just basic rendering and no post-processing effects, in other words, not even close to how the final game will look, has big plans for its anticipated 2021 release. Expect a big single-player campaign featuring a full storyline spread out over 20 levels. The online multiplayer will feature 32v32 player matches with vehicles and most likely aerial combat. Keep a close eye on Steampunk and expect an online beta sometime in 2020. Cortopia Studios Down the Rabbit Hole, which was originally slated to launch next week on PlayStation VR, has unfortunately been delayed slightly into early April. No reason for the delay has been announced, but we're still very much looking forward to playing this one as soon as it gets here. But the big news of the day is that Headmaster, a PSVR launch title, is finally getting its first ever DLC called The Lost Lessons. The DLC started as an idea to revive old level concepts that never made it into the game the first time around, which resulted in 10 brand new single player levels featuring all new mechanics, such as trampolines, miniature targets, and more, all of which were deemed either too dangerous, too difficult, or too expensive to become part of the curriculum at the Football Improvement Center. In addition, The Lost Lessons includes a new party mode level for a six player local multiplayer, and the ability to enter Carl's Workshop for the first time. Currently slated for release sometime in April, the Headmaster DLC will sell for $8 and should breathe new life into one of PSVR's most underappreciated games. Carl, what is 3274 doing here? What if they got signs? Then who would we graduate? What was that? Carl, you complete. Oh. Right. <laughs> Alright you guys, it's all the breaking news I have for you today, but make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can stay up to date with all the latest PlayStation VR reviews, Let's Plays, podcasts, and of course breaking news. As always, I'm Brian Paul, and I love you all.